OpenTIR is a metadata field that was created as a way to easily add new levels of categorization beyond those available in UCS. Let's say you're working with vehicles and you'd like to create specific categories for the different models of cars and also separate interior and exterior recordings. You could easily add these new subcategories using OpenTIR. For Urban Atmos, we thought we could put these features to good use. So, in this database, we have the sounds from the 7.0.2 version of our library. Here, I've got two metadata fields, file name and category full. I'm going to open the linked filter search panel. Let's assume that I'm selecting a few city ambiences for a film, and that it's my first contact with this library. One way I could navigate the collection would be by using the category full field criteria. When I open it, I can see the UCS categories of the sounds present in this library. In our case, mainly ambiences. The arrow to the left of ambience opens up UCS subcategories. In this case, construction, park, traffic, and urban. If I click on traffic, I'll see all the sounds that fit into this subcategory, so I can start listening and choosing. And that works just fine. But traffic is still a very broad term. What if I wanted to be a little more specific? Well, that's when open tier comes in. First, looks like we've got the same info we already had in category full. The difference is that now I can go beyond those. If I click on traffic, I'll see different subcategories corresponding to various city spots and settings. So now, not only do I have the broad term traffic, but I can also pick between the traffic on an avenue, a bridge, highway, intersection, road, roundabout, side street, street, and even a wet road. I can even go a little further and click on the arrow besides avenue, revealing yet another subcategory that classifies these environments into busy and calm. So I could be looking for a busy avenue like this, or a calm alley like this one. OpenTIR makes this type of search a lot easier, especially if you're getting to know the library. And that's pretty much it. Thank you for listening.